It is common for new mothers to experience frequent headaches. The cause of these headaches can be something as simple as lack of sleep or dehydration or something as severe as migraines. However, it's not healthy to keep popping pills every time you experience a headache. Fortunately, there are a few yogic breathing techniques that you can practice even with your busy schedule that will help prevent these troublesome headaches. Let me explain some of these techniques. Brahmari means a humming bee and it is a yogic breathing technique where you make the sounds of a humming bee. This pranayam not only provides relief from headaches but also promotes relaxation of the mind and body. It has also shown to improve the quality of sleep and reduces anxiety. Sit in any comfortable position. In the Brahmari pranayam, you will be making the hum sound with your mouth. So something like this. Hum. Now keep your back straight and place your hands on either side of your head and insert your thumbs into your ears. Wrap the rest of your fingers around your face, covering your eyes. Now, inhale and as you exhale, start to make the humming sound, like this. Hum. You can practice this for a minimum of five times every day. The more you practice, the more you'll be able to feel the vibrations throughout your body. Practice the Brahmari whenever you have some time alone. With time, you will start to feel that your entire body resonates with the sound of the hmm. The Anulom Vilom Pranayam is another great technique that you should practice regularly. It may appear a little confusing initially, but once you practice it consistently, then it will flow with ease. Start with sitting in any comfortable meditative asana. Bring your right hand into the Nasika Mudra by folding the index finger and the middle finger in. Now close your left nostril with your ring finger and start to inhale deeply through the right nostril. Once you inhale completely, hold your breath, close the right nostril with your right thumb and gently exhale through the left. Now, inhale through the left again, hold your breath, close your left nostril and exhale through the right nostril. This is one round of Anulom Vilom Pranayam. It is recommended to practice this technique five to seven times daily. The Anulom Vilom Pranayam balances the right and left side of your brain to bring about a balance in your entire body. This Pranayam is the best for meditation as it encourages you to focus on your breathing and balance. Our breath is the first thing that gets impacted by our feelings and moods. The quality of your breath changes throughout the day, depending on how you're feeling. It is shallow when you feel stressed and nervous and deep when you feel relaxed and calm. The best way to understand this is to observe your baby when he or she is resting. You will notice long, slow, full inhalations and exhalations. This is the sign of a relaxed body. Deep breathing is a great technique to control your breath and calm your mind. Sit in any comfortable meditative asana. You can even sit against a wall for support. Now close your eyes and take a couple of long inhalations and exhalations. Gently open your eyes and now start to inhale to a count of four. So start to inhale, one, two, three, Four. Now hold your breath for a count of four. One, two, three, four. Now exhale to a count of four. One, two, three, and four. Do this for a total of five minutes daily. At any given point of time, we only use one nostril to inhale and exhale. You can actually check this throughout the day. We hardly ever use both the nostrils at the same time. Since our breath is intimately connected to our minds, by calming our breaths, we calm our minds. These practices may seem boring and even frustrating initially, but after a few weeks, you will start to feel the difference.